boy, this stuff is starting to smell awesome. Ooh, you smell that? You smell that? Guys at home, I wanted to watch on this dish. This Asian chicken just whop. Ooh, voila. I know my chicken's coming out all right. How's your rice coming? Great. Remember, guys, my hands are washed. Mm. Now it's time to add in the veg. Little bit of carrots. Some broccoli. No, you don't want to put it in too soon because it will get soggy. You stir it. Yeah, that's right, because vegetables actually cook yes. pretty fast. It's easy to get mushy. That's just awesome. Look at that. Beautiful. I mean, mm -hmm. just such a, a little thing, like two different mm -hmm. vegetables. Yeah. You know, you could probably even do it with tomatoes, olives, all kind Any of different vegetables. stuff. Yeah, even some nuts, yes. some walnuts in the rice. That would be really fantastic. I don't think it would go with our dish here today, but for another dish at home, just a little quick and easy idea. Mm, let me stir this up a bit. We have our finished product here. And we have the one that is working on in here. I almost feel like mixing up my finished product with this one and then serving right from the pan because you know we have our tasters waiting, baby, to eat our food. And I done tell her already, just because that a boss lady, no means no need to say good. Because I know one might say nice when one might not think it nice. Just like my vegetarian wrap. Hey, Tell me something, did you like that, that vegetarian wrap? Yeah. You really did? Yes, it was good. I wonder if a lot of people at home tried it. I met someone the other day that told me they tried it, but that their kids didn't like it because it was too much vegetables. You don't have to put as much. That's true, you could lessen it. Um, but you really did like it because I know you yes, said I did. that was the first time that you've ever actually tasted it. it people think I'm nuts, I eat that every day. It was very tasty. Now, here we have a plate with what the finished product is gonna look like. Check that out. Nice little presentation there. We've got the rice rolled on quite nicely, and then the chicken laid out, and then some of the sauce. Um, and I'm also gonna be serving out another plate for our taster. But So that's actually what it's gonna look like. And you guys can choose to garnish your plate any way you want, basically. You can use, you don't even have to garnish. You can use anything you want. And if you want, you can serve a little side salad with this dish. There's just so much that you can do with this. And it's really, honestly, I know everybody that believes no about stew chicken, so they're kind of the same basic cooking technique, just different ingredients. You got your basic chicken and then different ingredients that go along with it. Oh, watch how that to come out. No! Wow! Check this out. Wow! I don't know why I had a pond diet. Boy, I want to eat this food. I ain't tricking on. Hmm. Look at, oh my goodness. Check this out, guys at home. Ooh, wee baby. And you know, this would probably go really good with meats like pork. You can even probably do it with steak. Yeah, with beef. Beef strips or anything. It's just no limitations to what you can do with this dish. So I know a lot of people are pressed for time. A lot of people say it's hard for them to cook. Guys, we did this in under 30 minutes. The rice took us, what, five? The chicken, 20 maximum, even with the with the prepping and whatnot. So, when I go cook, believe me, we gave you one recipe and about 10 different ways to use it. You think it's time we uh, serve out this dish to our tasters? You guys ready over there? Alrighty guys, we're bringing this stuff up to you here today. I know, check this out, this only happened once a week and all. Boss, bring food to the table. Check that out, look at that, look at that. Mm. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to taste. And you have to kind of like spicy food, but you know for the guys at home, for the audience out there, um, they can actually take it light on the um, jalapenos. They don't really need to put as much, you know? All right guys, sample away. I want to taste the rice first because I don't really like broccoli, so I'm going to see if I'm going to like this. Let's one. see, I want to see who wants to respond to my food. 
और देन और देन देन पने हुई नहीं हम्म I want you to take your first bite savor it savor it how does it taste uh-huh. Make a year. Make a year. It's great. Uh-huh. It's hot. It's hot. It's spicy. It's spicy. But you can kind of have a little sweet, sweet. Yeah, that's where the honey comes in. It's really almost like a sweet and sourish. Smoky sweet and sourish. Yeah, kind of. We just invent. Remember in the kitchen that day, we just invent that. Well, I invented it, but. And we cook it here a lot now. You guys have adopted. A lot of my recipes don't use, but. Hey, hey man, like I can smell it. It's pretty good smell. Oh, snap! Oh, it smells so good. I, ooh, I can't handle. I need to lose a few pounds. Hey. Uh huh. Tell me. You left my diet. I have that. <laughs> have to give props to that one day. Definite. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I know, right? Wait, so Mel, last week you made eat sweet pepper, and now you eat broccoli. So I got you to eat all kind of foods that you don't I'm normally big, eat. I'm not a big fan of vegetables, but I'm getting there. You see, you and see. The rice healthy too. Yeah. Rice healthy as well. Mhm. Mm it's all about the seasoning, the flavors, the combination of foods. You know what? You know what strikes me as odd? People think I can't cook. I like duh. I didn't have a restaurant business. I didn't have a business for nine years. What kind of person deals in a restaurant when no cook? That really, I, that, I find that to be funny. I don't find that to be funny. Perfectly al dente, Joe. Well, that's love. You know, she got that packed down. Huh, watch them eat. Well, love, I guess we did our, let's do a high five. We did our job today at Smoky Licious. I think uh, we need to head out. Watch them eat non stop. We need to go on like me, not cooking with the Smoky Mermaid. That's, that's exactly. <laughs> Dane, you need to wait for true. <laughs> All right, guys at home, I think it's time we wrap it up because these guys are going nuts. Next week, same time, same place, right here on Positive Vibes. I know it's a morning show and we're not doing morning dishes, but write it down, try it later. We'll be back. I know they want to finish eat. <laughs> we'll be back. We've got a spaghetti bolognese in store for you next week. And along with that, we have all different ways to teach you how to use the leftovers. We're doing nachos, tacos, and soups with the same spaghetti bolognese sauce that we'll be making for you. So, from all of us here at the Smoky Mermaid, guys, we're signing out. <laughs>